Hello guys, happy Monday. It is 9.50. No, it's not. It's 8.50. I'm in the lab. I realised I did not plan this week at all last week because last week, as you'll see from the previous vlog, was a bit of a weird one. So I need to sit here now, take out my iPad, look at my meetings and what's scheduled for the week and make an in-depth plan of what I'm going to do every day. So that's how I'm going to start off my Monday. Let's go. Hello, hello, hello. I don't really have much to report on. It's lunchtime now and I gathered all my glassware for the experiment tomorrow and labelled everything, washed everything. So that's ready to go tomorrow. I like to be prepared the day before. So it saves me the stress of the day of the experiment. I still need to prepare the sample, which I will do this afternoon. I was drying the round bottom flask to remove all the solvent so I can weigh the sample inside the round bottom flask. So I'm going to weigh that now. And then I'm going to have lunch. And for the majority of the day, I've actually been working on my thesis so uh, I've been trying to write one of my chapters. I got into a rabbit hole of analysing some data to try and put into the thesis. Did not get very far with that. It's basically NMR data I'm trying to solve a structure from just 1D NMR, so just proton NMR, because I do not have the 2D and I do not have the sample anymore. So that's not going very well. <laughs> Luckily, it looks to be a derivative of another compound that I've isolated, so I think I can get I can write something about it, just can't confirm the actual structure at this stage, which is a big, big shame. But yeah, today is mainly thesis writing and preparing for tomorrow. But now I'm gonna weigh the flask and then I need to have lunch, I'm hungry. <laughs> So here is my sample. I dried it into the round bottom flask, which I weighed before I dried it. And I'm hoping it's going to be around 10 grams, but from looking at it, I don't think it is. So I might have to add more. The moment of truth. Oh, wait, I need to get the weight from when I weighed it with no sample. So I did my calculation and it's actually only four grams. Oh, look, you can see me in the round bottom flask. Hello. Um, yeah, it's actually only four grams. So I'm going to need to add some more of the liquid and dry it again on the road to bath. Hello friends, happy Tuesday. Um, since yesterday, we actually don't need to wear our masks in the building anymore, which makes me feel kind of weird, but I am enjoying this freedom of being able to breathe in the lab, uh, which is great. Our lab is not overcrowded or anything and our benches are all pretty spaced out. So I feel completely safe not wearing the mask. But yes, it's strange. After all this time, we have gotten used to wearing masks, which is such a strange, strange, concept to me. Anyway, what have I been up to today? First of all, let me mention the sun is shining. It's glorious outside and again I'm feeling energized and I'm coming back to life. So I'm beginning to lean towards thinking that the weather does have like a huge influence on me, which is kind of crazy. What have I been up to today? Oh, this is a bit shaky. I'm trying to use one hand because I was getting a sore arm. So I have been doing a VLC, a vacuum liquid chromatography of more of the extract. So you would have seen in a few vlogs ago, I spent my Saturday doing this very nice and colorful column and I'm doing it again on the other half of the extract because it worked so well. And I did that this morning and I am an expert at doing this column now. So I managed to do it in a few hours. Everything went swimmingly. So I'm very, very pleased. But for now it's half past 12 and I think I'm going to go enjoy some of the sunshine, eat my lunch outside and read my book for a while. And that's my plan. Oh, also my round bottom flask broke today, which had my sample inside. <sighs> So that was fun. That was the first thing that happened this morning, but I did not get stressed. I tried to relax. I tried to be calm. Yeah, something has definitely changed in me compared to the last couple of vlogs where I've just been like ah, tired, stressed and not feeling the vibes. So that's what's going on. I'm going to have lunch and then I'm going to prepare some samples for LCMS in the afternoon. And I've got a meeting at three o'clock. Need to remember that. Okay, now for lunch. Got my iPad. I'm going to go read in front of King's College. Hello guys, good morning. It is Wednesday and it's currently quarter past eight and I'm going to leave in about five minutes to drop off this little boy. But I just thought I would give him a little um, moment in the vlog because he is my little morning buddy this morning, aren't you? He wants to say hello. <laughs> so this week I'm actually dog sitting. Well, not dog sitting, he's my dog. He's my parents' dog, but my parents are not here. So he is hanging out with me when I am not at university. So we're gonna drop him off at doggy daycare and then I'm gonna go to uni and then we're gonna start drying those fractions from the VLC yesterday. 
Hello friends, I am doing a task which I've been putting off for a long time so I'm waiting for my sample to dry on the Rotovap and I need to prepare new LCMS vials, new, L new LCMS samples so I can compare the results from this VLC to the previous one I did to make sure everything was the same so I can combine the fractions together <sighs> but I still have all of the old samples that I need to put back into the original vials so that's what I'm dealing with right now. This is the situation I've literally been putting it off for ages. I have all of my Eppendor and I also have these LCMS vials which I need to collect from the lab and I need to put them into their vials. It's just one of those boring tasks that you just keep putting off because you don't want to do it. But I'm going to put on a podcast, there's some music and just get on with it.